Hey, what's up YouTube? Dope is Yoli here. Hope you're having a dope day. Welcome back to the channel. So if you read the title, guys, you already kind of know what's going on. I met Rosie over 10 years ago. We just started hanging out. She was just becoming one of my best friends and I, I liked her. I knew I liked her. I didn't want to say anything to ruin it. Then come to find out, if you watch the story time, she did the same thing. She liked me, didn't want to ruin it. And it just started great. It started as she's one of my best friends and it turned into, I love this person. And that was nine years ago. And you guys already know, Rosie and I are in no rush to get married. I love her, she loves me, we're best friends. I'm not going anywhere, she's not going anywhere. We're not in a rush. But for the past couple months, guys, it's been on my brain every day. I've been planning this since last April. And then in July, my uncle got sick, so I kind of waited a little bit. And then in August, he passed away, so I've just been sad, guys. I'm gonna be honest, I've just been really sad about it. And the past couple months, I've started to kind of come out of my funk about it, so now I'm in a good mood, I'm happy, and I'm, I'm ready. So guys, yesterday I went to Tiffany's, the diamond store, and I bought an engagement ring. I did not film it because I was just gonna put the deposit that was gonna film me picking it up. I told my friend John which ring I got, and he automatically says, fool, you're stupid. Why don't you come to me first? Fool, take it back, and I'm taking you to my jeweler. My homie has so many diamonds, it's ridiculous. I don't know why I didn't call him first. I'm just dumb. So today I went back to Tiffany's, got all my money back, and right now I'm on my way to pick my friend John up. He's gonna take me to his jeweler in Hollywood, and yeah, guys, today I am, I'm buying the engagement ring to give to Rosie. I'm gonna propose to her this Saturday at the Push Trees house. I've been lining this up. I've been waiting till we go to Merced and we're going to Merced this weekend. I'm gonna make this whole elaborate plan that I'm doing this other video. You need to be here, get dressed up. And when she walks in, I'm gonna propose to Rosie. I'm gonna propose to Rosie at the 27th Street house, the Push Trees house. I'm gonna propose to her in the room that I fell in love with her, in my living room looking at my front door. I remember the day she walked in, she had a red knitted beanie on and that's the day I went, I love you so much. And that was it, that's the day. So I wanna be in the same exact spot when I proposed to her. I know it sounds kinda, kinda cheesy. Not a lot of people get to get that chance. And her friend's mom still lives at the house we used to live at. So I'm gonna go give her some money and go, hey, go do some stuff for a couple hours and pretend that I'm filming a story time or something. Rosie has no idea, guys. She has no clue. I I'm I'm just really excited. I'm just happy. I'm happy she's gonna be happy. I I, I already know what her little face is gonna look like. I, I played this through my head a thousand times where it's gonna be, how it's gonna be. I just, I'm excited, guys, this weekend. This weekend, I'm gonna propose to Rosie and I cannot believe I'm saying that out loud. The only person in the world that knew about this is my Uncle John. He's the only guy, he's the only person I told that I was gonna do this and then he got sick. And it's so weird because when I went to go buy the ring yesterday, I left and I almost called my uncle. He's my uncle, but he was also like my older brother. You know what I mean? He's known me my whole life. We hang out, we do everything, we eat candy together, we drink. It's like, that's my older brother and he's gone. He's been gone for six months. And yesterday when I bought the ring, I was gonna call him and then I remembered, that's right, he's gone. But this is not a sad day, this is a happy day, guys. I'm about to go buy the ring and let's get started. Yo, it's so much nicer in the daytime and not in your garage. Oof. It's in the car. The key's in the car? That's when you know you're in a nice neighborhood. Okay, we're off to the jeweler and my homie's car is just, it's ridiculous. It's so nice, dude. Oh, a little car seat. <laughs> What's up guys, it is Thursday. I am on the way to the warehouse. 
we have a very special guest today we have Shabo from System of a Down as our podcast guest super cool guy such a nice dude and a straight up rock star so today's gonna be really cool I'm excited for this podcast the reason you didn't see so much footage in the jewelry store is because they were closing and I didn't really want to like yo can you bring all your stuff back out for me so that's why I didn't get too much but I will show more of the ring it is so nice I really really like it shout out to my homie for really like coming through taking me to Beverly Hills taking me to his jeweler it was the easiest thing I paid the man and left it was so easy but yeah guys Rosie thinks we are filming a video at the push trees house so that's the whole plot that's why she has no idea she thinks we're just filming a video and then I'm gonna pop it out so this is what's gonna happen guys for the next two days you are gonna see me fake vlogging so this whole time Rosie's gonna be in her own proposal vlog and she has no idea I am so excited. I'm pulling off the best prank. Guten Pranken. I'm so excited, guys. She has no idea. She has no idea. I just can't wait to see her face. I'm hyped. Hey, what's up, YouTube? Dope is Yola here. Hope you're having a dope day. Welcome back to the channel. I'm with Rosie. Okay. And this is gonna be a vlog. We are going to Merced because it's my niece's first birthday party. I know it's COVID and all that, but I'm just gonna go say hi. I have to see her. I have only seen her once since she's been alive. Once or twice, if that. Twice. Because of COVID, twice. so I haven't seen her at all. It's my brother's first kid, my little brother's first kid. With that being said, we are about to get in the car. We got a rental car. We got a rental car. First time I've driven an SUV. I'm so excited. I've never drove an SUV. They upgraded me and said, we're upgrading you. But you know, the insurance <laughs> is more and the gas is more but it's upgrade. I'm like, hey, that doesn't sound sick at all. <laughs> that sounds like I just got charged more because you're out of cars. All right, so let's get started. Let's get this vlog road trip montage started. Let's go. It is kind of weird just lying like that on camera, but I got to make her believe we're doing a different vlog so she doesn't ask, why do you got the cameras out? The next time I'm in this warehouse, we will be engaged. And then she says, I need more time, which would be hilarious. All right, guys, thanks for being on this vlog with us. This is a very special vlog. I appreciate you guys for being here. All right, let's get going. It's so weird lying. It's so weird lying to her. Hey, remember when you had no idea what was going on? Can you hear me right now? Okay, all right. Let's go. I didn't close the door. <laughs> Watch out, puppies. Good morning. It is Saturday. <laughs> We're about to go to the Push Trees house and film that vlog. There's Rosie with her American flag colors. All right, I'm gonna get ready. I ate pizza and macaroni last night like an idiot and now my stomach hurt. This is my uncle and aunt's backyard. My uncle John from Storytime. Last name, super sick in wood. I just wanna show his backyard. He really made it nice before he went up, before he passed away, guys. So guys, I just woke up. I went and dropped my cousin off at Saturday school. He got in trouble. He's the same, just like me in senior year. He got in trouble, so now he's going to Saturday school until the year's over. But yeah, guys, today's the day. I'm sorry I'm talking quiet because Rosie's right in there with the computer, but today's the day. I'm very, very hyped. I just called my dad right now and told him. He's all hyped up too. My mom, I told my mom. Rosie's in there, she has no idea. I'm so happy that she thinks it's another vlog. This is, this couldn't have worked better. So guys, next time you see me, I'll be at the Push Trees house. Let's go. Rosie and I, what we started hanging out, what, 2010? Started dating in 2011, right? Yes. 2011, dang, it's about to be 10 years. It's about to be 10 years, Rosie, since we were eating chicken sandwiches and trying to make our rent. Quick update, our friend's mom that lives there is kind of being difficult. Not sure if we're gonna be able to get in the house. She's. It's her day off or something, I don't know. All right, if you've been following our Instagram since the beginning, you know and you will recognize this place. This is where Rosie and I started everything. Push Tree's house, started doing Dope Yola. Every single thing started right here. So yes, Rosie was my friend. We just hung out right here until, well, you guys have heard the story time. <laughs> All right, guys, this is it. This is the first Push Tree's house where we started everything. It's pretty cool. It looks so much nicer. Just a FYI, it looks a lot nicer here now, guys. Remember when the tree just fell? fell? 
We woke up and our whole tree was on the ground and then we just left it. And the uh, hilarious video, this is it right here where the stuff was falling from the sky. Oh, Everything, yeah. remember? Yeah, the right picture here. that just dropped, the picture that just dropped the uh, tree pusher with the nug skating, that's the exact spot where I did the first original tech deck picture. And back there, the tree's gone, but the push trees tree used to be right there, and that's the original picture. Yeah, they, they tore it down. This is going on our 10th year. We started everything. We have a warehouse now, it's so sick. We have multiple businesses. <laughs> right? Look at this cage you built. I know, I love it. This little garden area. Shut up. I love you so much. Shut up. I need to ask. Yeah? Size it. It's too big. You said you were six. You said you were a six. It's too big. It's okay. It's okay. It's What up? Okay, well she said I might need more time. <laughs> she didn't Shut say up. <laughs> uh, So I thought it was a six. She's definitely a five and a half. This ring is too big, but that's all that matters. Last time we were here, we took this exact picture. Oh, we did. Ah, <sighs> hi. Well, it's official. I know. <laughs> Hi, Miss Thomas. My You're mom, on camera. My mom knew already. I know. I said you knew. I knew, but... I cried so much. I know you did. I knew you were going to. I cried so much. All right, I'm going to show you something I didn't tell you. Dude, are you... Did you buy a Ranger? Oh, I had to. Are you with Justin? No, he's at the shop and I'm at the restaurant. Okay, but are you ready? Yes. Oh! <laughs> I already knew. I already knew. I already knew. I was so excited. I was like, I can't wait to test it. I can't wait to test it. I can't wait to congratulations. What's up, guys? Uh, we are officially back in LA. Hello? What's up? Rosie's dressed like Clueless. It's awesome. It's awesome. <laughs> so guys, uh, a couple weeks ago, I lied to Rosie and said, hey, my friend makes rings. Uh, what size ring are you? She's gonna give you one. Oh I just tried to get, God, oh I yeah. I forgot to tell you, that was a lie. 
She doesn't make avocado rings. I was waiting for rings. avocado rings. <laughs> she doesn't make avocado rings. I thought I was getting I avocado rings. I forgot to tell you that was a lie. Um, anyway, she said she's a size six. Rosie, t show them, show them your finger. Now show them the back of your finger. <laughs> Uh, there's tape right there so it doesn't Gra fall off. His grandma forced me to put it on. <laughs> so the ring is massively too big, way too big. So right now we are on Rodeo Drive. We are going to Peter Marco and we are gonna go get her ring sized. Nice, oh that's the Louis store. There's a line at the Louis store? Jesus. I, go to that um, store. I think it's a right, right here if I believe. Cause I remember Ooh, me and John were up. eating candy in the car and there was a cop. So we stopped eating candy. We need to come down here. Yeah, this is bomb. It's right here. Yep, parking right here. So while we're waiting for the ring to get sized, Rosie and I came to get the first oil change on the car. 1A or something they call it from Mercedes. And we're in Beverly Hills and we bought way too much stuff at the gift shop, but there's so much there dope, so much stuff. dope stuff. It's cool. Yep. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, man. Sure. You too. Have a good day. Bye. Bye. Thank you. We're here. Real Food Daily. Ready? Dude, I know guys, this is the GTA street. I know, I know. It's so cool looking. It's so fun. There it is. All right. Hi. What's up guys? Um, sorry. It's officially been over a week since Rosie and I have been engaged and we forgot to finish the vlog. <laughs> We've been so busy. We did a podcast, two podcasts this week. We did I don't know how many hundreds and hundreds of orders. So guys, this is the end of the vlog. Rosie and I are officially engaged, about to get married. I don't know when. I have no idea. <laughs> I don't know when yet, guys. We haven't planned it. And I know a lot of you are thinking, you should do it after COVID so you can invite everybody. Nope. Rosie and I are gonna use COVID as a, hey, you know, we can't have a lot of people there. Uh, I don't wanna invite everybody I've ever met. It's just no. something I don't wanna do. I don't want this big wedding singer wedding. I want it to be our friends and our family, the people we actually have on our phones that we care about. So we got it sized and I guess you lost some weight this week because it is getting loose. It's because I've been doing the gluten-free diet with you. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Okay guys, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for being a part of this. Um, best prank, best vlog ever. I had no idea. She had no idea. <laughs> Once again, she had no idea guys. Thank you so much. We are about to knock it all out. We are about to do another podcast. We did one last night. I fell really hard on a skateboard in front of a pro skater that we interviewed last night. And it was really humbling. <laughs> My whole back and elbow wrist hurts, but it was worth it. It was fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. Rosie and I are going to keep working because that's our lives. Thank you guys so much for watching. This has been another video on the Adventures of Yola channel, proposing to my girlfriend. Now Rose is about to be my wife. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a dope ass day.